y'all it's Taylor welcome back to my channel today we are going to do three exercises or three things I like to do before my workout that decompress my lower back so these are stretches just things that you can do that really help me personally so I think they'll help you too first is a Jefferson curl so you want to have something tied pretty much close to the floor and you're gonna step in here and then you'll just sit get into this position and so notice how I'm breathing super super deep um, I try to hold for two out for two um, this is really great for people who are flexible that need some more resistance in the stretch to kind of you know, get that decompression going. You can sit any way you want. So you can do one leg in, one leg out, and then just go. And I like to do this side as well, or this way as well. Breathing when you stretch is super important. So if you're holding your breath, uh, it's not gonna work. You're not gonna get the most out of the stretch. So just make sure your breathing is breathing. And then obviously, you'll do those sides. Next thing we have, you want to be in an elevated position. So we're going to just stand on something elevated, grab a kettlebell, and This next one is really good for stretching out your lats. Um, your lats run this way, so obviously they're connected to your lower back. I always try to make sure I'm relaxing in these. Um, I know that sounds weird, but a lot of people just don't relax in general, so make sure you completely tell yourself to relax. I'm about to hit squats, so definitely my back was feeling tight because I did RDLs, not yesterday, but the day before. Those are the three exercises or stretches. Um, I recommend doing them if you have back pain or you know, you're know you about to squat heavy. Any kind of decompression um, thing is really great for your back. Just make sure you're being careful, be safe, um, and make sure you're breathing. Y'all have a great day. Like, subscribe, follow, comment below what you want me to do next.